Hello friends, welcome. Now, if I click here, we have this return only the string. I want to go to the page of the skills index. And then there I want to, to display all the skills we have. Right now we don't have any, but let's go and work with that. So inside of the controller, skill controller here, instead of returning this, I want to return a page inside the resources JS pages. I want to create the skill index page here. For that, I'm going to create inside the pages, I'm going to create a folder. I'm going to name it skills. And inside that, I'm going to create the index dot view component, which is the page here. And let's add the view first. Okay. I don't want the styles here. So I'm going to remove. I don't want the export because I'm going to use the setup. Okay. Here, what I want first, I'm going to import what we have in the dashboard. I'm going to import the Breeze authenticated layout and also the head. So let's copy that and paste it here. Also, I'm going to copy the title, the head, and let's paste it now inside the template. I'm going to change the title to be uh, skills index. Okay, next we need to add the present dedicated layout and also here we have the header slot and the default slot is going to render this one. I think you know uh, Vue.js because I'm not going to show you how the Vue.js working, uh, but I'm going to show you how to create the portfolio website with Laravel and Inertia.js. So let's paste that in. Instead of a dashboard, I'm going to say skills, and this is the this header here. And now inside of this one, I'm, I don't want to show you are logged in, but I want to show, I want to display the table with all the skills. Right now we don't have. I'm going to say here table for now, and let's save this page. Now at this page, I want to render when we click here. So if I go to the skill controller, instead of returning this, I want to render that page. So I'm going to say inertia, render, and I want to render the component as you can see here, which is inside the pages. And we don't need to add pages here, but what we need, need to add is this skills so let's add skills and inside the skills we need to add the index view now here we don't add the dot but we add slash and the name of the page which is index or the name of the component and with that just now if i save and let's go and refresh if i click skills we navigate to the portfolio test skills and we don't have reloading. And here we have skills, as you can see, and we have the table. Very good. The same thing I'm going to do for the projects. So first let's go in the pages and I'm going to create a new folder. I'm going to name it projects. And then here a new file, index.view, index.view. And now to save some time, I'm going to go inside the skills index and select all here, copy, close this and paste in this index.view, which is inside the projects. I'm going to change the skills to be projects because we are in the projects. Also here, projects. Okay. And we are going to display the table of the projects here. Let's save and let's close this. Let's close this one. And let's go in the project controller. Here now, 
instead of this, we are going to return and render that component we created. So inertia render. Now the component is inside the projects and slash the name is index. That's it. Save. Let's come here and let's refresh. If I click to the projects, we are now inside the projects. We have projects index, the title, the header is projects and we have the table here. Okay, that's it about this video. In the next video, I'm going to add a link here on the right to go to the projects create and the same thing for the skills. Okay, so see you there.